So hello, let's do the giveaway contest. I did not forget, I'll go over that in a little bit. But first, let's get it out of the way. So there were seven entries. Uh, we got Peter, Mitchum, Strategic, Aaron, uh, Half Heart, Arnable, and John Murray from one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Random, gen random number generator, one to seven. The result is number five, which would be Half Heart Games. So Half Heart Games, please send me a private message on here with your mailing address and I will ship out that book right away. So, no, I did not forget about this. I uh, I actually did not have the opportunity to record it until today. Today is Thursday. This video is going up Friday. Um, last weekend, which would be the end of the contest, October 31st, Halloween, I was originally planning to do a video on November 1st uh, for Mondays to announce the winner of the, the contest. But my parents decided, or not, didn't decide, my parents new house, finished building, and so I went home last weekend to help them move into it. Uh, so I was gone for the whole weekend. I didn't have a chance to do this. This was going to be done on Tuesday because I my wife was scheduled to work then, and so I was like, okay, great. I can do it on Tuesday, upload it Wednesday. Uh, she was scheduled to work till like 6, and so I was, you know, I was at home at 5.30, and she came home early, which destroyed that plan. So anyways, here we are today. She's at work. <laughs> Till seven today for sure. It's now uh, six o'clock about, so should have enough time to do this video. Just good. Um, <clears throat> uh, so, anyways, last week uh, or this week, I guess there were no gameplay videos, and the reason being, I I didn't have any. Uh, it's not that I didn't have any edited. I just didn't have any recorded. Uh, this this last month, October has been really really strange uh, with her work schedule, and usually when uh, when she's working on weekends, that's why I went out. The weekends are when I like to record. I don't like recording during the week because I'm so uh, exhausted and stressed off from work that I just don't want to play really. Um, well, I want to play it, but I can't play well to where I want to play well. Anyways, I, I limit it to the weekends just because I, I can do it right after I wake up, eat lunch, play a few games while I'm nice and refreshed, and I do a lot better. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, her, her schedule has been really, really strange this last month compared to, say, the, you know, the nine months prior, where... She used to get either working both days on the weekends or not working both days on the weekends. And the days that she doesn't work on the weekends are the days that we go home and visit my parents back in my hometown and uh, hang out with some friends and that sort of stuff. Uh, usually holidays are this sort of example. And days that she works are the days that I record videos. And the days that she works both days, which again has been most of them, I record Enough for a full week, plus maybe a couple more videos. Um, for a while there, I was actually doing two weeks per week, and I was actually getting a pretty good buffer. Um, as of September, I had a week buffer going through it, which means I could skip a week and still be caught up. Um, start of October, her cousin got married, which ate up the buffer uh, during that next week. And then I've been maintaining it until this last weekend, and I didn't have a buffer. So that is why I have not been able to, uh, or that's why I didn't put any videos out this week. Um, and because of all of October, she was working one day or not. Uh, the other day, I only had enough time on one day to really record three videos. Um, I don't like playing more than three games. Just again, you get exhausted, you get uh, worn out, and then you just, I, I can't play that much. I don't like playing that much. So that's what happened last week. Uh, going forward, and this, this obstacle has been glaring at me for the last six months because we, we've had this plan for a while uh it just it, it's getting closer and closer and i still haven't really figured out what i want to do so come december she is quitting her job she's going to be a full-time stay-at-home wife to be stay-at-home mother um and again we've been planning this for months it's not like i didn't know it was coming but um that's you know i'm out the way and so i've been i've been trying to figure out what i want to do with uh, recording videos. I still want to record videos. I like doing it. I like the editing of it, especially. Um, I like playing Go. I also like playing other games, and I'm, I've am i mentioned this multiple times. Maybe start doing some stuff with that. Just a, one, a little variety, and two, other stuff interests me too, and I kind of have some, I don't know, urge to do something, some creative stuff with that too. I, I don't know, whatever. Um, and so I've been going, or I've been making a list of some of the solutions that we can do to this, and um, possible outcomes or actions come December when she quits her job. What we can do for the, the channel. The first option, obviously, is not to make videos anymore. Don't want to do that. Like I said, I want to make videos. I just got to figure out how. 
Uh, second option that came to mind was move my computer into the back room. You know, I should uh, not talk while the siren's going. Happens every six o'clock, it's just a daily thing. Anyway, uh, move the computer into the back room, which is right directly behind me. But then me and her isolated at all times, and I don't really want to move the computer back and forth. Computers plus movement plus how much, how heavy that thing is, and all the cords and stuff, not, not, uh, not a good thing. Um, next option would be to ask her to hide for a couple hours at a time. Um, it, you know, in the past, if she's, if she comes home in the middle of the video, I ask, you know, can you wait 20 minutes, or whatever, till I finish this? And then she goes and hides, takes a mobile device of some sort, like her Kindle or phone or whatever, or her sketch pad and draws and, you know, hides away in the, in the bedroom while I finish out here. Um, but I, I don't want to make that a regular thing. Uh, one, it's not fair to her because she gets so bored in there because, you know, you got this nice computer with full access to the internet and now you're limited to a, a little mobile phone. So I don't I don't want to do that. Another thing that came to mind was to go back to my laptop for recording. And when I'm recording, record in the back room. But then when I'm not recording, I come out here and use the, the main computer. This has a few flaws, like one, moving my recording equipment back and forth because I do use that mic for chatting with my friends online um, while we play uh, through Steam and that sort of stuff. So that's kind of a pain, so either you got to get new set of equipment. The laptop only has one screen. And for video editing and for um, for recording especially, it's nice to have the two screens because XSplit can capture the one screen and all the other programs can be on the opposite screen while you, so you can monitor them. Like right now I have the, the webcam right here, I have XSplit over here showing you what's on the screen over there, and then I have the, the audio, the bars going up and down over here. So I won't be able to monitor that, I'd have to be all minimized and stuff. And and so the the last option and the one I'm, I'm, I'm leaning to because I think it has the, the most promise, praise, prospect, whatever you want to call it, is to just record out here with her there. So she, she'll be adding a little bit to the background noise with you know whatever she's working on, whatever she's doing. She gets up and does the dishes. There might be some of that sort of stuff. Or if she's watching something on the television or wh whatever it's, it's going on in there, there might be some additional background noise. But I think with the, the mic set to... Oh, and I don't remember the name, but it only picks up stuff in front of the mic and not the back of the mic. It will cut out a lot of the other stuff for the most part. But I, I also don't think it's going to be that big of a, a, a distraction or notice. I'm just, I'm just thinking back to what I, what I did with, with Talisman and the, the screen sheet games. Those were with my, my real life friends, uh, Pat mainly and, uh, Matt and Kyle on Talisman. And throughout both of those games, while we were, you know, chatting on Skype, she was watching something on the television and not now i'm pretty sure the television was turned down to a lower level it wasn't at its normal just casual listening to it it was a little bit quieter than normal but it wasn't it, it didn't seem to be that big of a of a noise at her or pollution i guess so um i will try to do some of that come december and see how that goes if it's just not working, then I'll explore some other option, like going back to the laptop or something if I need to. Um, at, yeah, I'm going through all this. It makes it sound like she's the problem. No, okay, so she, it's, it's not her, it's not her fault. It's not any of that. It, it's, it's me wanting to spend the time with her while she's around. I myself spend about 50 hours at work every week, 40 hours working plus hour lunches plus about an hour travel time each day times five days. Um, it's about 50 hours away from her. And then now with her, you know, schedule being, kind of weird she works on weekends and at times I don't there isn't a whole lot of overlap so there'll be a lot more overlap now and so with even if I end up going in the back room and hiding away for a couple hours it will still be more than what we have currently and I think she'll more than likely understand that yeah okay I, you can go hide away and do your recordings for a couple hours and it won't be uh won't be unfair to her that I'm hiding away, I guess. But that's the reason as to why it is, or how it is currently, where I try to spend as much time as with her as I can when she's around. So anyways, that's uh, about all I had to say about that. Uh, like I said, it's going to be a weird transition come December with adjusting to her being at home and figuring out what we're going to do with that. But I do still plan to make videos. Um, I'm hoping that over the next, uh, well, next week she's going to be gone to a casino. The weekend after is Thanksgiving. I think she works a few of the days there. Um, in between those two weekends, 
one, I should be able to catch back up. I mean, this weekend, this upcoming weekend, I have a day, so I'll be getting goal videos off for the next week. I'm saying that the, the weekends after, I should be able to catch back up, get a little bit of a buffer, and my goal, my tentative goal, is to finish what I want to do with Get Strong and Opening. Um, I haven't yet started on that. I've got the problems picked out of what I want to do. I just haven't made the videos of them and how exactly I want to approach that stuff. But that that's my goal. I want to finish that this month so that you know, if, for whatever reason, I have to cut way back on the recording and only focus on games, at least that book is done. So that's about all I got to say. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.